द अपलांट एंड द रिस्पोंडेंट इंटर्ड इन टू अ मेमोरेंडम ऑफ अंडरस्टैंडिंग वेयर इन द अपलांट प्रपोज टू कॉन्स्टिट्यूट अ ज्वाइंट वेंचर एलोंग विद एनदर कंपनी फॉर सेटिंग अप एन एलुमिना प्लांट अंडर क्लॉज नाइनटीन इट वॉज स्टिपुलेटेड दैट द एम ओ यू वॉज सब्जेक्ट टू अप्रूवल ऑफ द बोर्ड ऑफ डायरेक्टर्स ऑफ द अपलांट एज वेल एज द रिस्पोंडेंट इट वॉज फर्दर स्पेसिफिकली मैंशनड दैट आफ्टर गेटिंग नेसेसरी अप्रूवल बाय बोथ साइड्स द एम ओ यू वुड बी कन्वर्टेड इन टू एन एग्रीमेंट बिटवीन द अपलांट एंड द रिस्पोंडेंट क्लॉज ट्वेंटी सिक्स ऑफ द एम ओ यू प्रोवाइडेड फॉर रिजोल्यूशन ऑफ डिस्प्यूट्स ऑब्लिक डिफरेंस इन द फर्स्ट इंस्टेंस एमिकेबली बाय म्यूचुअल कंसल्टेशन एंड क्लॉज ट्वेंटी सेवन प्रोवाइडेड दैट इफ एमिकेबल सेटलमेंट इज नॉट रीच्ड बिटवीन द पार्टीज देन सच अनरिजोल्व डिस्प्यूट्स और डिफरेंसेज कंसर्निंग और अराइजिंग फ्रॉम द एम ओ यू and its implementation breach or termination whatsoever shall be referred to the arbitration of a sole arbitrator appointed by the parties and the arbitration shall be governed by the arbitration and conciliation act comma 1996 in bracket india and conducted in the city of ahmedabad subsequent to the signing of the mou the respondent cancelled the mou alleging failure on the part of the appellant in complying with various terms and conditions of the mou para in response the appellant requested the respondent to make an attempt for an amicable settlement in terms of clause 26 of the mou full stop since its attempt to amicably resolve the dispute as provided failed the appellant caused a legal notice to the respondent invoking clause 27 of the mou to appoint an arbitrator full stop stating that there was no fault whatsoever and therefore there was no question of any obligation to be fulfilled on its side comma the respondent expressed its decision not to concur in the appointment of the arbitrator full stop as the application filed by the applicant under section 11 of the arbitration and conciliation act comma 1996 for appointment of arbitrator was rejected by the high court comma the applicant had filed the present appeal full stop para The question before the Supreme Court was whether the arbitration clause contained in the MOU is a stand alone agreement or not full stop allowing the appeal the Supreme Court held semicolon the arbitration clause contained in clause 27 of the MOU is an independent arbitration agreement and therefore comma even if the respondent close to terminate the mou dated 17.8.2007 comma the arbitration agreement would continue to remain and consequently the parties are entitled to invoke the said clause 27 and exercise their option for appointment of an arbitrator and seek for concurrence of the other party full stop para under section 16 in bracket 1 of the 1996 act comma the legislature makes it clear that while considering any objection with respect to the existence or validity of the arbitration agreement comma the arbitration clause which formed part of the contract comma has to be treated as an agreement independent of the other terms of the contract full stop to ensure that there is no misunderstanding comma section 16 in bracket 1 in bracket b of the 1996 act further provides that even if the arbitral tribunal concludes that the main contract is null and void comma it should not result as a matter of law in an automatic invalidation of the arbitration clause comma section 16 in bracket 1 in bracket a 
of the 1996 act presumes the existence of a valid arbitration clause and mandates the same to be treated as an agreement independent of the other terms of the contract full stop by virtue of section 16 in bracket 1 in bracket b it continues to be enforceable notwithstanding a declaration of the contract being null and void full stop in view of the provisions contained in section 16 in bracket 1 of the arbitration and conciliation act comma 1996 comma it would not be possible to accept the submission that with the termination of mou comma the arbitration clause would also cease to exist full stop para in the present case comma clause 27 of the mou provides that in the event of failure of an amicable settlement at the bilateral level relating to a dispute or difference arising between the appellant and the respondent to be reached as contained in clause 26 of the mou comma then such unresolved dispute or difference concerning or arising from the mou comma its implementation comma breach or termination whatsoever including any difference or dispute as to the interpretation of any of the terms of the mou is referable to the sole arbitrator appointed by the appellant and the respondent full stop therefore irrespective of the question or as to the fact whether the mou fructified into a full fledged agreement having regard to the non fulfillment of any of the conditions or failure of compliance with any requirement by either of the parties stipulated in the other clauses of mou a specific agreement has been entered into by the appellant and the respondent under clause 27 to refer such controversies as between the parties to the sole arbitrator by consensus full stop over